All right, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Zuchi. Welcome back to another Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel video. In today's video, we're finally going to be using the 60 card Megalith Drytron. It barely has any Megalith in there. I have a different Megalith deck that I will be using. Don't worry about it. That one's more difficult than this one. I'm going to show you guys the deck real quick. Before we get into it, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Hit that like button, comment, share, subscribe. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do more 60 card versions of decks like Cyber Dragon, Dinos, and I'll probably try to see if I can make that come true. With cards like Grass is Greener um, that's active in this game, there's a lot of 60 card decks that we could do. Like that Skull Servant, like the Samurai X did one that I wanted to do, which is the Skull Servant one. And that's honestly a really, really, really fun and good deck that I really would want to try. So yeah, definitely let me know in the comments. And without further ado, let's just jump straight into the deck okay and here is the deck list this is what we have so far i would want to run like a a dpe when that card drops or if it ever gets released because uh you're gonna need cards like those why do i have 16 cards this deck uh i feel like you're probably gonna want to go second because of the amount of hand traps that we have right and the ability to otk uh i don't expect the brick too much because we have three of it, three of all of these but we also have a bunch of hand traps like i said so uh we'll we'll see how it works when we hop in we could this video could go either really well or it could go either really bad but without further ado let's just hop straight in you can you can download an app called Yu-Gi-Oh neuron on your phone and if you scan the screen it will give you every card that is on the screen right now so yeah without further ado hop into the matches all right so we get to go second here oh we have a really really good hand this is really good, actually. Let's see what happens. This, I think we could OTK with this hand. I, I kept the extra deck the same as the other dread shot. Well, GG. <laughs> GG, I guess. <laughs> we go to the deck. All right, so we get to go second one more time. We keep winning the coin toss. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm feeling proud. I'm feeling kind of proud. Okay, let's see what happens here. Do we still have a Beatrice? That's good. Uh... Reactive slime. We should let we're gonna let him do all his summons and then we're gonna we're gonna go uh into our Nibir. Alright. Okay, well. It looks like he's playing a god deck. Alright, should we just win? Can we just win through this? We probably can. So let's do this. We go here. We we'll activate it. Send the Ben 10. Alright, then we'll bring. Honestly, do we bring this guy? Should we bring this guy? And then summon out this guy to pop his entire field. Then go into our OTKs. Maybe, maybe we could. Or we could just do Ben 10 for now. Ben 10 will add. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's add one ritual monster. Yeah, we could do this. What do we want to do this? What can I send with you? I could add a ritual monster. Okay, let's see what we can do. First, we're going to do this. We're going to bring out... Do we have that ritual spell in our hand? No, so we're going to bring out the Zeta. Attack. We're going to link Karibo. Then we're gonna activate the Zeta. Send the Ben 10. Let's put it here. Bring the ritual card. That's perfect. Activate Ben 10 in the graveyard. Then we get to add. Um we just add another Ben 10. And then afterwards we can add a lance here. Right? Right? Yes. Go into Mu Beta. Let's go here. Activate it. Yes, we're making moves. Send the Ben 10, uh, the Gamma to the graveyard, sorry. Do I have anything in the graveyard? I mean, I guess we could do this. We do the normal plays, right?
I could have gone into a level four, but we'll do this. We will do this instead. And then we get to add to our hand. We'll add you. The megalith full. Then we activate. Actually, no, we'll bring it the Ben 10. We'll bring out the Ben 10. Alright, use one from here. This is perfect. We're looking really good right now. Uh, here. And then we'll go into Beatrice. We'll activate Beatrice to send a card to the graveyard. We're probably going to send a Gyritron. Because we don't have run Eva in this deck. So we'll send to the graveyard. Might as well send the level 4000 monster, right? Or the 4000 attack monster? Is that what we're thinking? Is that what we're thinking? Nah, we'll send you. Actually, maybe. Maybe. Just so we can have it there, right? Let's send it. Let's send it. Might as well. <clears throat> Alright. Okay, so we might have to use this to bring out this. Is that even possible? Is that what we could do here? I think we could do that. I think we can do that. Let's get rid of this. All right, then let's go here. Back in the attack. Activate Ben 10. Ben 10 is going to add something. He's going to add the lens. We'll add the lens to our hand. It's perfect. Then we get to activate this. Hold on, let's see what we want to do actually. Because I could use this, bring out the 4,000 attack. Hmm, we gotta think, we gotta think. Let me activate this. Let's just summon this. We'll use from our hand. Use this. Why not? Why not, right? I doubt he's gonna. Let's get rid of Nibiru. Put it in defense. Then we get to add. With the effect of full, we get to add to our hand, I'm pretty sure. The level of that target. Okay, uh, well, we, we really don't matter which one we make it, honestly. Make it sick. Why not? Uh, if this card is ritual summoned, you can target one ritual monster in your graveyard. This card to begin. Then add that target to your hand. During your main phase, you can activate this ritual from your hand or deck by paying. How many Bethor do I run? I only run the one. That's kind of crazy. Okay, so we'll go into this. One. Two and do we need this? Do we need this? The question. Oh no, we're thinking. We're thinking. We'll go here. I guess we'll just send the <laughs> the lens here. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't really matter. We'll just send back a card to the hand. No. Oh, back to the deck, sorry. Then we could bring out the 4,000 attack. What does this do? Alright. <clears throat> Let's see. Can we bring out a card from the deck? No. We'll special summon this. We'll go here. We use this. Alright, he's not going to have another turn, so we might as well. It doesn't really matter what you do. Then we activate Ophiel. Cancel. Ophiel adds one to our hand. 
if this card is just you can add one of his key from your hand all right now we can go here now we can go into this guy we'll use this and we'll use this put it in attack i wish i had the old feel on the field before i put the full on the field you know okay this is only once we turn i think Okay, so then we'll go into our access code talker. One. We use the full. We don't need it anymore. This is perfect. This is perfect. Activate. This is good. Why not? Activate this as well. Banish. Yeah, and then we can just attack the game here. And that's a G a G's. Honestly. The deck is really consistent. It's more consistent than you guys actually think. And I'll show you guys in this video. Alright, we get to go second again. We keep winning the coin toss. I'm not gonna lie to you. We keep winning. Okay, this is really good, really good, not bad at all. We have, like I said, you want to go second with this deck. We have Forbidden Droplet, which is really good, just in case he has anything crazy. Like if he summons, we can drop it a Calamities, right? We can drop it Calamities, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we can. So let's just see what kind of deck he has. If he takes too long, we'll just skip the turn, then uh, just go directly to our turn. Ooh, red eyes, red eyes, okay. He banishes this, then he spells it summons a level 7. He has to add Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon, activate that effect. He has to special summon one monster from the hand, which is going to be a Red Eyes Dragon. Red Eyes Black Flare Dragon. Okay, I haven't seen this one in such a long time. All this card is normal summoned to the field. Okay, that was it. Okay, 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 okay. If that is it... Draw! Okay, okay. Alright, calm down here. Calm down, what can we do? So we could try to make an Ap Apollo USA. Okay. Or we can go into a level 4. Wait, did I not put a level 4 in this deck? Okay, well, that's something we're going to have to do. I forgot to put the level 4 in the deck. Oh no. Oh no. Hey, okay, no, we'll activate this. Yes. Add the <laughs> We're gonna bring out the goat. I honestly, maybe I shouldn't bring him out. No, I have it in the hand already, so we'll bring out you. Right, all right, all right, calm down, calm down. We're gonna have to go into Link Kareeb. Well, maybe not yet, maybe not yet. Take this, we have to send to the graveyard. Add to the hand. No. Okay, okay, okay. What do we want to add to the hand here? Let's bring out the full. Alright, so we'll add this to the hand. Okay. Then we're going to bring out. Link Kervibo, cause why not? I could use this now, bring him out, activate that. But I don't want to do that, that's the thing. Okay, let's just do it. This is the Bethor could really help us here. It is what it is, honestly. Bring Ben 10. I 
Activate this. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Calm down. Calm down. Because I could use this now, honestly. At level eight, though. That's a level eight. Well, we have to make plays around. Normally, you don't want to do this, but we kind of didn't have any other choice in the meta. Let's go here. We're going to send the Gamma. Yeah, we're going to send Gamma. I think that's the better move. Then we're going to activate the Gamma. No. Draw. A face of attack. We'll go into the Mi Beta. Mi Beta will send. We'll send Delta. You know, it's crazy because I didn't actually need to go into the Mi Beta. Now that I'm really thinking about it. I did not need to go into the Mi Beta at all. No. Draw! Draw! Okay, then we get to go. Mm, what do we want to do? What do we want to do? Because we could do this. Wait a second. We go one, two, three. We go best Thor. Yeah, we'll activate this. No. Get rid of one. Bethor can pop one because we only have one on the field. No. Okay. What can we activate? This. No point. No point. We can go one, two, three, four. Attack. But will that do enough damage? I could have done something different here. I could have made a different play. And we would have won this turn. But I might have messed up. Should we go into an app Appaloosa and then sit on just sit on Appaloosa? Should we go one, two, three. Send. Let's go on a level four Apollo USA, right? Do we agree? Do we agree on a level four Apollo USA? Or do we want to go here? Okay, we have to make a valid decision here, okay? A very valid decision. Let's go up Apollo, Apollo USA. I would have done more damage. But I feel like this is better. Let me just go into the attack because now we have monster negates. And then we also have this just in case. Let's end our turn. It's just unfortunate. We didn't really draw anything good but we we're still able to make our plays but I, like i said we could have won that turn still but i messed up but it is what it is it still worked out a little bit okay tj what do you have for me monster reborn okay i get it i understand i get it how 
How much attack is that? Is that 26 or just... Okay, if this card... The end of the battle phase, 24. Okay, let me see what he does. You can tribute this to one level seven. Okay, we'll let it go through. Zen, if he goes into uh, Red Eyes, Darkness, Metal Dragon or something, we'll activate. Yes, because that's a level seven, level seven. He can overlay. I don't want him to crash, not yet at least. Let's see. Yeah, he overlays into big guy. He's going to try to take our monster. Fine. I'm going to activate this now. We'll send this. There we go. And now we should be good. We should be okay. Let's see. What can you do here? I just sneezed. I'm sorry. I had to mute the mic. I had to mute. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, we have Big Eye on the field number eleven. Uh, he's think he probably has a monster in his hand. So we should win here, honestly. We should just win. Yeah, he scoops it up. All right, we'll go into the next match. All right, so we do get to go second again. This time we lost the coin toss, but beautiful hand. Beautiful hand. It looks like we have here. We have literally every hand, like we run 60 cards and we're able to get off this kind of hand. It's kind of crazy, isn't it? Okay, what do we have? What do we have here? Do I run Lightning Storm in this deck? Why did I not put Lightning Storm in here? This is crazy. This is insane. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. It looks like he's running Eldritch. Yeah, I was going to say, he just automatically activates that. Once he gets an Eldritch on the field, can we play through? Can we play through? Okay, let's see. We'll activate you. You think he has Imperial Order? If he has Imperial Order and Skill Drain, I'm going to fight someone. Someone is getting fought, honestly. Let's, let's see. Oh my god. Oh wait. Look, we activate Cyber Emergency. Mm, I should have just... Well, I mean... I guess it's better that we did it this way. Skill Drain. Skill Drain is fine. Alright, so... We'll activate... Th we'll activate this. Just so I can draw another card. Okay, that's fine. Perfect. Show him that. We draw one. Oh, Natasha. Oh, we can Natasha steal. We could try. We could indeed try. What's in the graveyard? Oh, this. Um, let's keep it in the graveyard. Let's keep it in the graveyard. Then we could tribute to you. Then we can bring forth our ritual spell. Okay, let's see what happens here. Can't really go into anything that I actually want. I mean, we could get rid of Skill Drain here. We really could. But I just want to see if he has something. Oh, he's called by... Okay, okay. Oh. I kind of figured that he would have that. Okay, well... There's not much I can do here, honestly. Not much I can do at all.
Mm. Should we just get the ritual summon out of the way? Nah. We'll wait. I really wanted to get rid of that skill drain really bad. Okay, well, we'll just... We could take damage, go to Zeus, right? Okay. Let's see. Go to Zeus here. We'll just take the damage, and then we'll go to Zeus. My thinking is... Well, I know he can't... Um... Activate his effect, but we'll sit on Zeus, right? Just for the 3000 defense. And then we'll chill right here. And that's that. Oh, I hate skill drain so much. Such a cheap card. Such a cheap card. It literally stops you from well, I guess that's what it, that's the point of the card, but when it's at three and it, you can draw into it, it's crazy. It's honestly just crazy. But it's fun trying to play around it. We're probably gonna lose, but uh, not much we can do there. Not much we can do about it. Okay. He gets to set the conquist. Is that the conquistador? I didn't get to see. Let's see. Uh, wrong one. This is the conquistador. Yeah, this one lets you destroy one card on the field. So that's probably gonna be this. What a waste of Zeus, honestly. Let's see what he does. End his turn. He has to activate it now, so. Because he has that on the field. Can we draw on to a Ben 10? Yes, we can. What do you think he's going to do here? We're going to activate this. We're going to go into Ben 10. We'll send the Bethor. Oh, Bethor! Oh, why don't I just do that? Oh, Ash. Hey, never mind. I guess, I guess I'm just not gonna play, you know what I mean? Okay, what is he doing? What is he doing? Is he decing? Oh my god, please. Please! <laughs> Let me get a free win. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. Waiting for a response. Maybe he got a phone call or something. Man might be playing on his phone now. Yeah. Let's go. Scoop it up. We're going to the next deck. The deck is so good that it makes Eldritch players forget how to play. You know what I mean? He could have done so many plays with that Conquistador right there. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We're going to the next match. All right, we're going second one more time. One more time with a decent hand again. Pretty decent hand. We can send a Drytron to the graveyard here. Probably going to be the alpha. And we can add this field spell. We add the Nova to our hand. What is this? Right hand shark. Okay. Uh, and we have triple tactics. Ooh. Does he end his turn? Pass. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. Let's see what we draw in two seconds. Ready? Draw. Ooh, Manju. Manju. Manju can add one ritual monster or ritual spell. We really don't need the Zeta, I'm gonna be honest with you. Let's add this. Okay, he gets uh, his field lit up so he can activate something. We're gonna activate the field spell. Okay. Let's add this. We have Alpha, and we have Zeta. Let's do Alpha Zeta.
Okay, hold on. Alright, we'll switch someone out to Zeta. Please don't be a call to buy. Thank you. If it's a call to buy, I will cry. Nice, okay, he's passing it up. Love to see it. Now we add the Ben 10. Okay, then we activate the Zeta, tributing the Ben 10. Then we get to add the Ritual spell. We're looking good so far. Looking good. Ben 10 will add <clears throat> another Ben 10. Okay, good. Okay, then we activate this. We're going to Zeus. If we wanted to, we could try. There's no reason to. We'll send the Gamma. Okay, what is this? Tribute one fish, then target one card on the field. And if you do, oh, destroy it. Okay. Well, it is what it is. On honestly, I don't know. You want me to tell you? It is what it is. Hey, okay. can we still win through this? Probably. Could just chill with the Zeus. Ben 10 will add our Ben 10, and then the last Ben 10 could add the Lance here. Should, should I normal summon? We'll go here. He will send you. When we activate that. We add to our hand the Ophio. Yes, we'll add the Ophio. Ain't going to the mute beta yet. We'll activate this. Shit, I might just want to go to the mute beta because I want an extra card on the field. Forget about his effect. We just need that extra card. Hey, we're here. Face up. We're looking good. We're looking pretty good. No. Draw. Okay, hey, then we go into the Beatrice. Beatrice will send Delta. We'll send Delta. Why not? Why not? Perfect. Delta activates. Go here. We'll show him the... The feel. Nice. Ben 10 will bring our... Lance here. We set called by. It's because it's annoying right now. We'll activate this. Which is, uh, you can add the key there. You may feel you can activate this effect. Which is someone one from by trading monsters. Okay. We'll bring out the. Ophiel first, I think that's what we want to do here. You can add one ritual monster from your deck to the hand. That Ophiel. No, let's go here.
let's go here. Well, we'll just put it in attack because we're already in attack mode anyway. Turn two, activate. Ben 10, of course. Not yet. Then we can activate this. We're going to ritual summon. And especially summon out the Bethel. I guess we don't need that. Don't need Bent. Okay, I can only choose one. Bent 10. We need a level 2. I mean, might as well. Might as well. Just to get cards on the field. Just to get the cards that we need on the field. Bethel gets rid of this. No. Ben 10 activates. Then we get to add a Natasha to our hand. A nice, lovely Natasha. Destroy! What is that? Uh, Poseidon, when a monster declares an attack, target the attacking monster to get the attack. And if you do, inflict 800 for each. Okay, he didn't control any, so that really was kind of useless to him, but. It happens like that sometimes. We go three, so one, two, three. I did not need to do this. I did not need to do that at all, but I wanted to. So 3,500. Okay, well, I might have messed up again. I might have messed up one more time. Oh, I hate to see it. You hate to see it, honestly. It's one of those situations where I have to pay more attention to what I'm doing. It's okay, though, because we still can win here. We can still win. I should have waited, honestly. I think that would have been the better play. And just attack. And maybe go into Zeus. Because we could have OTK'd again. Um. This is strange. What do I want to do? 22, 25. 47. That's 15. Okay, let's just go into... It's not going to be enough to kill, I don't think, but it is what it is. It is what it is. It's going to be 70. Yeah, it's, we're going to be a little... We, I think he has like 200 life points left. Yeah. But we have Zeus still. So that's fine. We have a two material Zeus. So we can chill for a little bit. We should be good. We should be okay. Let's see. Let us see. Yeah, we should be perfectly fine here. Nothing to worry about. He's going to set some cards. We're going to get rid of it. GG. GG. Alright, that's going to be it for the matches, guys. Hopefully, you guys really did enjoy. Here's the deck. Uh, 60 card Drytron. It's actually pretty consistent. Uh, like I said, you're mainly going to want to go turn 2 to clear your opponent's board. You can OTK, but most of the time you won't OTK. Because I... Well, you will OTK if you play right, because I apparently just didn't know what I was doing, apparently, but it still worked out in the end. Uh, like I said, this deck is actually really, really consistent. If you draw, like, none of these can be considered brick, right? Because you're drawing Hand Trap, so that's not a brick. If you're already disrupting their turn one play, they can't OTK you. Or you'd either, or you draw into your, uh, your main plays, which is also really good. You have the Megalith engine as well. I'm going to add, so what I wanted to add was uh, this card right here this level four and i forgot to add it i might get rid of one of this and just add this right so i think that would be better 
because you have this card which becomes a level four and then you also have this you can go into there and you could sit on this card and negate all of their effects and stuff like that so i think that would be the better card to add if i was to remove anything and it should have been what i added honestly because it really messed me up where i couldn't go into that card and i wanted to do that play but i couldn't because you know obviously it wasn't in the deck and i just forgot to add it but like i said it's really really consistent out of out of all those matches we drew into our dry Trunk cards a lot we run three of them so we're probably going to join to it and we drew into a bunch of hand traps nibiru is really good valor ghost ogre um ash blossom those are really good i run this card just because we have one of everything just in case they have anything they want to use right so I think the 60 card Drytron deck is pretty good. I don't know if you want to run it in the Platinum. I don't know how well it would do. It would, like I said, disrupt all of your opponent's plays. But I'd have to test it out more. Like This is the first time I tried it, which was on this video with you guys. So I don't know. We'll see if it does better over the time that I decide to test it out. I didn't draw into Imperm once. It's kind of crazy, but it is what it is. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like button, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.